Where are they? They're in this room here. Let's go get them. Come on, here. Today, I'm diving into the archives. <laughs> baseball there it is There's some un oh, unopened packs let's get them out and take a look at them it's okay. been a while it's been a while since might we looked be, at these might be a little dusty <laughs> yeah <laughs> looks like they are Do you remember how we acquired so many baseball cards? Uh, Mom was uh, the concession stand manager, and so we had her buy a couple boxes a couple times. Yeah, but it was more than that. Well, yeah. Just because we had the boxes of cards here doesn't mean got the packs. that we got the packs. The boxes sat on top of the refrigerator, if you remember. Right. And when we did well in our baseball games that's when we got the packs of cards mm -hmm. that's the team yeah. there yeah. i happen to see two people i know three there's sam a pop one yeah me there's you yeah i still got that shirt <laughs> yeah and you wear it look this is the old cardinal shirt <laughs> i can't believe you still wear that yeah, i've got some wear it. <laughs> well, we found two boxes of cards they're that, the same uh, brand. That has not been opened yet. What this year is, a, is that? This is 93 and this is 93 But as these well. aren't the good ones because they don't have the bubble gum. They don't have the bubble the tops gum? tops have the bubble gum. Yes, I know. Yeah, the tops. This was, in 1993, this pack would retail for a $1.98 is what it says. Dollar ninety-eight. Dollar Open it up. Chipper Jones. Chipper Jones, pull it all out. Chipper Jones. So this is the 1993 Chipper Jones that Dad yeah. just opened. Yeah, it just. Is that what it says? The land, Florida. Yeah, and his hometown is Pearson, Florida. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. So the reason that I wanted to actually pull these baseball cards out and talk about them, one of the reasons is because it's National Baseball Card Day on August 10th. Tops made it August 10th. It's a Tops thing. And if you go to a baseball or a card collector shop and Topps is in that shop, they might have something for you on August 10th. So make sure you go visit the, the card shop. Let's look at some of this stuff. There's a lot of cards here. There is a lot this of cards. So thing. this is my book that I could check if I had the card or not. And I would write them down and then whenever I got it, I would check it. Check it off the list. You got Chipper Jones? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You got it now. Hang on, That's so funny. Look, Look at this. this. Oh, and this is Tom's yeah. list. Oh, wow. So what else do we have here? So, oh, this was a... So where's one. Tops at? Do we have any Tops? I don't know. Put that back in the pool pack, man. Wow. Here's the Beckett's. Soaring Stars. Jim Abbott. Remember Jim Abbott? Jim Abbott was the one-handed pitcher. Yes. One-handed pitcher. Yep. As we used to look stuff up in the Becketts. Which oh, right yeah. We have a collection of Becketts as well. Let's yeah, see that. Is, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, Dusty. Uh, Open that up. But, little uh, Ricky Henderson right there on the cover. Yeah, this is a little bent up there. Uh, but is that, who's that's, that, Cal Ripken? Yeah, of course, that's Ripken. Oh, Joe DiMaggio and Mantle, is that who we got there? Oh, David, David Justice. Justice. David Justice, yeah, he was the man. Frank Thomas. Bo Jackson. Bo! You Bo. might want to go to the game tonight. <laughs> Bo is actually in Jacksonville today. That's funny. He's going to be at the Jacksonville Jumbo Shrimp game tonight. Throwing should, out the first pitch. Yeah, he's throwing out the first pitch tonight. I should go get that signed. It would probably give him some memories. 
There's a list of the teams. Wow. That's, this is funny too, actually. These came in the Don Russ packs. They have the puzzle cards. I remember that. This is the Carl Yaskrumski oh, yes. puzzle oh, card. Carl Yaskrumski played for the Boston Red Sox. Yeah. And he played with Roger, well, against him was Mickey Mantle. I saw that game. And Roger Maris. And, uh, boy, I tell you, there, there's a lot of ones. My dad used to take me to the ball games. All, all these are Nolan Ryan cards. Oh, I remember. I, I like to collect Nolan Ryan cards. I had a thing to collect Nolan Ryan cards. All Nolan Ryan. There we go. These are all numbered. Let's see here. What year are we looking for? 89. Well, there's a Griffey MVP. We never really collected the upper deck cards. Those were the more expensive cards. <laughs> but the tops, Don Ross, Fleer, Score, all those we collected. Oh, is this bubble gum? No, it's just a take. <laughs> you want the bubble gum? No. If we had one pack of bubble gum, would you try it? Mm -mm. Why not? No. Come on. They probably would. It's, it's sealed. If it's sealed? If it's sealed, why not? Yeah. It'd be hard as a rock. You might break a tooth. <laughs> you bought a complete set. Okay. Remember what you said about the unopened sealed pack? Where did you get this at? <laughs> oh, but this is this is been opened. Nope. This is an unopened pack of 1987 Topps baseball cards. Uh, Where did you get these at? And they still have the bubble gum in them. Bubble Where did you see this? <laughs> Where did you get this at? Bubble gum cards. Look at Wade Boggs is on the side of the box. Sammy Sosa. Yeah. Those the old guys. Well, these are 1987, so these should be good. There we go. I'm actually kind of worried. <laughs> oh, it's missing. A, it's missing. Somebody got one. A pack? Yeah. Yeah, maybe they did. Yeah. How do they smell? They smell good? No, they don't. <laughs> wax paper. Here's the bubble gum right here. <laughs> so it should be. Oh, so I'm gonna try it. Here we go. Go ahead. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Uh, it's actually not bad. <laughs> it doesn't chew anymore. It doesn't chew. It's actually breaking up like a, like a, um, oh God, it's terrible. <laughs> so why should I try it? <laughs> oh. There you go. It doesn't even yeah. smell like bubble gum. I thought it was like a sweet tart at first. You gotta put the whole thing in your mouth. Oh, good. Good? Oh, yeah, good. just give it a second. <laughs> Actually tastes like cardboard. Okay, this is the one I had and I put it back. All right. So you get your choice. I'm gonna take that one. Still sealed. <laughs> Go for okay, it. Okay, you guys did it, so yep. I have to do it. Mm. That was crunchier. It's delicious. <laughs> Good. I swallowed mine. It's gonna gum up the world. Oh! I remember this flavor. Yeah. Good. I remember. No. Oh. Okay, who'd you get? It's disgusting. Yeah, it's not good. The cardboard from the baseball cards has melded into the gum, and you what? have that flavor. And for some reason, now the gum is gone, and I've accidentally <laughs> swallowed the whole thing. I, I was able to spit <laughs> mine out. So this was a lot of fun going through all the old stuff, all the old cards, opening the '87 tops, eating the gum. <laughs> that was not a good part. Okay, didn't taste good. Now I have this weird aftertaste in my mouth. So I need to go get a drink. <laughs> That's it for today. I'll see you again tomorrow. No, you can't be excused. We gotta do some pickup shots. You gotta eat the gum again one more time.
Go ahead and grab one piece each. No, no. No? You're not gonna do it? No, hang on, I'll hold the camera for you. No, 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 there's plenty. I got a whole box, we can do that. Here. I'll call Harold and see if he wants to do it. No, 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 come on. No. You, no, you're good? No. All right. This back. could be lunch. Tell him the gum wasn't good. <laughs>